Other news tonight, a case involving an infamous drug dealer is among the dozens that could be tossed out after an Eden Prairie officer was accused of falsifying a warrant. Corey Heppler talked with the mother of one of Beverly Burrell's victims to see what this news means for her. And you know, really it's been nearly three years, but still... Colleen Ronnie remembers looking into her son Luke's big blue eyes. And he said, no, I'm going to be OK, Mom, I've got this. You know, everything's going to be OK and I love you. Three hours later, Luke was gone after relapsing and accidentally overdosing on opioids. Beverly Burrell was charged in Luke's death. She's already in prison, convicted of murder and three other overdose deaths. Right now, it's, it's possible that she'll have spent 13 years in jail for five lives. Making matters trickier, Burrell's now one of more than 70 defendants whose cases are tied to Eden Prairie police officer Travis Serafin, who's accused of falsifying a search warrant. As a result, all of those he was involved in could be thrown out. Serafin's under investigation, and last Friday, Hennepin County came out strongly against him. While there should have never been this kind of dishonesty, in the first place, everyone has done their best to repair the damage as soon as possible. Yeah, Colleen knows Serafin so and sees it differently. I honestly believe it was a mistake, that it wasn't misconduct. But I'm not the person who gets to decide that. But Colleen has decided to make a difference. She started up the nonprofit Change the Outcome to help educate kids and change the stigma surrounding addiction. They even made a documentary, which debuts Monday at the Twin Cities Film Fest. How do we change the outcome for how law enforcement handles drug overdoses. You know, two, three years ago, they would just go, oh, well, bummer, they made a bad choice. Oh, we're going to post a link to that on our site, as well as a list of all the other cases that could get thrown out, a uh, link to her uh, documentary, that is. Burrell's attorney told me late today he's planning to file to get all five cases against his client dismissed. Eden Prairie Police say they hold their officers to high ethical standards and gives officers time for due process. Randy? All right, thank you, Corey.